Hi YouTube, it's Mr. Codicus. I'm going to show you an awesome cheat engine which you can use to change your ammo, money or lives on any game out there. Well, almost any game. This is a, a Mac cheat engine uh, and you can use it to hack flash games, uh, games on the internet, um, using web browsers such as Google Chrome, Firefox or Safari. Uh, or simple games like Minecraft. Right, first of all, you're going to install uh, and download BitSlicer. You want to, I'll put a link to the description by the way, but I'll show you anyway. You want to open up your web browser, type in BitSlicer. For Mac, top one, and it's here where it says download now. Okay, uh, once you've downloaded that um, uh, and installed BitSlicer, you just want to open it. It lost a few passwords. Put that in. Uh, and open it. There we go. You get something like this. Then you open the game or web browser you're going to use to uh, hack a game. Um, uh, I'm just going to demonstrate with Minecraft. Uh, you see in here, there's nothing called. Minecraft or anything like that. But if I open up my Minecraft, ends of the game. Um, and Minecraft launcher frame. There we go. That's this. Right. Now, I'm going to open up single player. Um, uh, I'll go into uh, one of my maps. Right. You see, I'll turn... Oh, I already have creative mode off. Um, right. See, down here, I have... 57 uh, blocks. Um, I'm going to go into here and I'm going to type 57 where it says value. Uh, you want to keep this as equals. There's different ones here. Keep it as equals because you try to find a value in the whole of Minecraft which is equal to um, exactly equal to what you want to find. So type in 57. You normally want to keep the same, uh, and that's pretty much it. So a search, and it should find a bunch of values. Because it's searching the whole of Minecraft for anything to do with the number 57. Just wait for that to finish. And that should just about do it. There we go. And we have almost 7,000 different values here. To narrow it down to the exact one we want, we'll go back to the game and I'll put a couple of these blocks down. There we go. I put three down. Uh, and I now have 54. Um, uh, so I'll type in 54. Search that. And it's found one that has changed from uh, what it was previously to 54. This will be the dirt block. Uh, just so you don't forget it, you can rename it dirt block. Or else if you want to. 
then here you have the value. If you click on the value, you can change the value. Uh, I've already got it quite high. I'll, I'll change it to um, 12. So I'll type 12 in. And if you watch down here, um, uh, where the blocks are on Minecraft, I'll click enter. And it's changed to 12. Uh, you can do this to anything. I'll put it on 35. And now it's 35. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you want to do it to a flash game, um, it yeah, will. As I say, if you've got an amount of blocks on a flash game, ammo, um, uh, lives, or money, um, what you're going to have to do, you get that amount, say you've got 10, 10 ammo, uh, uh, for the first value, you want to times it by 8, whatever it is. So you're going to say if you've got 10 ammo, you're going to times that by 8, you're going to get 80. You're going to type 80 in, search it, then say you shoot 5 bullets, uh, then you have 5 bullets left, you want to times that by 8, you've got, you times any value by 8 pretty much in a flash game, and you get 40, so you type 40 in as your new um, uh, value, and you should keep doing that till it narrows it down, and you'll get that, and you can change that. Uh, as I say, this also works on any web games or mini clip games or anything like that. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. This is Mr. Codicus.